The rush, but they've made it. Jazz and Geordie from Killing Joke in the studio with me. Good to see you, chaps. Hi. How goes it? Been away for a while, Jazz, for something like 18 months, and I understand that there's been something of a transformation within the group. You seem to have found yourselves or something in that period, don't you? Yes. Um, what we've been in, first of all, we were given a, a recording studio, which we we're paying for 20, 20 quid a day for in Chelsea, so we decided to move into this lovely recording studio and pay very little for it. And we started to do our own production, instead of getting a record producer in that you have to pay 30 grand to before we've even started. So we started to uh, learn our own production and write and record and produce everything ourselves. Uh, so we, that's the way we did this particular album, Outside the Gates. And when we finished that, we went off uh, around the world having right. fun. Sounds like fun. Geordie, um, I was reading the biog and it said something about the geometria system that you've been getting into. Geometria system. Geometria system. What's that about? Well, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> right, back to jazz. Well, that's right. I've got a big mouth, you see. That's why... Uh, that's why um, I answer these questions. Well, uh, we did a, a lecture to answer this question uh, on uh, September the 22nd at the Courtauld Institute in London, where we um, demonstrated the principles we used in the studio and with the music, basically. We did a seminar and talked to about 120 people and actually demonstrated the musical principles um, and the Gemetria system, which now the Gemetria system is a means of using Kabbalistic numerology within the tempo of the music. What's you see. that exactly? That is using the beats per minute, the tempo of the song, and uh, relating that to numerology, which is obviously an ascetic pursuit of ours. Good Lord, it sounds like quite heady, that. But so uh, let's pick up the conversation again Won't in a it. minute. <laughs> <laughs> well, I get over that explanation, Jasper. <laughs> I was winking, didn't you say? <laughs> <laughs> and he's a buckling after that. Let's take a look at uh, an older track from you. This is Love Like Blood. <laughs> Yeah. 
interesting joke for you there. I've got Jazz and Jordy in the studio. We're pretty short of time, Jazz. So tell us about these projects that you've been working on there. In the next few months, I'm, I'm uh, hoping for a performance of the symphony, which I worked on for about four years. It's a big project. Mm -hmm. And uh, the first edition of my book, which is down at my feet down here, <laughs> all right, um, will be coming out about two weeks after the album outside the gate is... Um, Released. Right. What's the book about? It's about nine years of killing joke. Oh, wow. Some <laughs> volume. It looks pretty thick, and I know That's there right. must be a lot of stories. That's right, yeah. Geordie, you've been hard at work writing the new material, I know. We're going to take a look at America, the new single, in a moment. Tell us a bit about that particular track. I mean, uh, the name itself suggests that uh, the subject matter could be quite interesting. Well, it's, it's more dealing with the consciousness of America as opposed to uh, a racial slur. Really? It worries us a bit, the Yanks, I'm afraid. <laughs> what do you make of the presidential uh, election going on at the moment, Jazz? Just well, as a side I mean, it's issue, quite, it, it, uh, as a separate issue, it's quite obvious that I think uh, Bush is going to get in, the Republicans are going to get in again. Yeah. But um, what concerns me most of all is the effect it has here, here in England. That the fact is, the Americans are overspending, and our economy is rooted in the American economy. Mm -hmm. And when they go, we're going to go. The fact is, the Wall Street crash that happened uh, six six months ago or so now. It's going to reoccur again in 24 months, and um, I think also the American foreign policy in the Gulf. There are a lot of things that are going to happen. This song documents what we see is about to happen. Okay, we've got a little bit of extra time, Geordie. Very quickly, tell me about New Zealand because I understand that was quite sort of instrumental in this kind of renaissance, I suppose you could call it, of the group, wasn't it? Um, well, I I'm married to a New Zealander. That's the first thing. So, take it over again, so yeah, yeah. I mean, I go over there to see my in-laws, right? It's very simple. And I go fishing. And he goes fishing. <laughs> <laughs> so um, dive around in the sea, that sort of but thing. I wouldn't know? have thought it sort of fitted into the Killing Joke game plan, in, in that it's a very quiet, remote kind of place. Isn't we it? hate people. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, it's three million people over there. Five million people travel on the underground every day, and we like an outdoor life. Simple as that. Great. Well, it's back to that subject of America. You're both looking very well. I've never seen you look so well, actually. It must have been a good 18 months. Nice outdoor life, you see. But in all the smoke and smog of the city, this is it, you know. All right. And you must both come back in for a longer interview, and we'll talk about the symphony and, indeed, the book and the new album in more depth. Thank you very much. Thanks for joining us, Jazz and Geordie from Killing Joke. Right. Let's take a look at that country so full of contradictions. The new single from the boys here, This Is America. <laughs> 